Police have doubled down on their action on Friday during a protest action in Bastyr, where three persons were arrested, reportedly for breaching the Public Order Act. The police, in a statement earlier this week, chided the handful of protesters who took to the streets to protest COVID-19 vaccination and what they deem an injustice where workers were dismissed for failing to take the vaccine. A press release issued by the St. Christopher and Nevis Police Force earlier this week stated that no application was submitted to the Commission of Police to hold the protest. The release referred to a warning that was issued earlier after police learned about the intended activity, in which police pointed out that such an activity would be illegal under, em under the Emergency Powers COVID-19 regulations and the Public Order Act. The release also stated that participants were in breach of several COVID-19 protocols, such as physical and social distancing and the wearing of masks. The release made no mention of a tear gas incident. On Tuesday, at the Prime Minister's press conference, Assistant Commissioner of Police Adolf Adams reiterated the police's position. Legal, illegal matches can cause um, property damage or structural damage to, to businesses. And so we would want to, I mean, not allow those things to happen within our federation. We also are saying illegal matches in the night are prohibited. We, we have seen the match on Friday going down to the, the wee hours of, of um, Friday evening, and these things are prohibited by the law. reason why these are not allowed are because persons can hide, hide behind the cover of darkness and engage in any type of activities. All right? We have officers who are out there on the ground, and we will do all in our power to ensure that our safety, the safety of the general public, is maintained at all times. As a result of the illegal march or protest on Friday, three persons were arrested and charges were brought against them. That is my update on the protest that took place on Friday. Three individuals were arrested and charged during the protest on August 20th, and they were released after appearing in the Bastyr Magistrates Court on Monday. The three were released on posting $15,000 bail each. It is understood that the Director of Public Prosecution intends to drop the charges against the three based on insufficient evidence. The charges laid against the three persons included taking part in a public procession without permission from the police, breach of the peace, willful obstruction, obstructing a police officer, resisting arrest, and malicious damage. I'm Andre Huey for SKN Newsline.